Okay, folks, uh, I just made a video there. It was telling you about when you're creating buses and the problem that you might lose sound is, to, is when you make the bus, you actually have to make sure it's set to stereo. And as soon as, as, soon as I made that video, uh, I get rid of the buses and because I just wanted to work off these levels. I didn't need them. Uh, and one of the things I noticed, as soon as I get rid of the buses, uh, my drums, this one here in white, if we play it, you can see the drums are playing. That's the groove agent there. And some of the other things disappeared as well. And what you have to actually do, there's the groove agent there. And if you've got the wee E indicator there, go to there. And it brings up the graph, uh, the graph equalizer. And it's right there. Right there in that bloody thing there. It says no target. So we need to click on that and set it to stereo. Because it's basically no bussing. So my drums are back now. So if you're creating subgroups, make sure it's in stereo. Uh, or, or you might lose your sound. And if you're deleting those groups, why you've deleted them, you're going to have to get into each track and make sure it's targeted for that. That's bullshit. You and I both know that's bullshit. That should automatically go that way or go that way. It should not be forcing us to go, what the fuck just happened there, man? Two videos about groups, subgroup things, and the wee still glitchy nonsense that's in Cubase. It's a pain in the ass, man.